Brianna, it's Vidden Day 8, November 8th, it's Thursday, it's almost Friday. <laughs> We're counting down the days to New York, um, there's only, there's only three days left, I don't know, it's going by really, really fast. Um, I'm doing this video kind of later in the day, so that's why I look so tired. <laughs> um, anyway. I was, uh, I was returning a client email today and I uh, wanted to, maybe it was yesterday, um, I wanted to talk about it because um, I think this is something that comes up a lot when people have lost some weight and they're not where they want to be yet. So um, if you had a friend... Well, the question I want to ask is, are you mean girling yourself? And I just came up with that term. <laughs> um, are you somebody that, let's say you have a friend who happens to be losing weight. And she comes to you and she says, hey, I lost 10, 15, 20, 30, 40 pounds, whatever the amount is that they've lost would you be like oh that's great but you really have a long way to go or oh I don't really see it <laughs> or would you you know point out that you know yeah but your stomach is still kind of big or but you haven't dropped a size yet or any of that stuff? Would you say that stuff to somebody else? Would you say that? Um, I find this a lot and I I tried not to do it to myself. I'm trying to, I keep trying to think back more about the beginning of my journey um, when I wasn't so secure that I would get to the end and, and kind of um, what were some of the things that I said to myself. But I know that it's really common for us to kind of take away any kind of our accomplishments by saying, well, but I still have a lot to lose, or I haven't dropped a size yet, or nobody's noticing, and that sort of thing. So I just want to tell you today on Thursday, no more mean girling yourself. If you're a guy, I know there are guys on this program. I know there are guys that are my clients. Um, if you're a guy, don't don't mean dude yourself. <laughs> um, I don't know. What do guys call other... What do they call mean guys? I don't know. This isn't really a family YouTube channel, so I guess I could curse, but, you know. Don't be a... You know. Anyways. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I just want to tell you guys uh, today that whether you still have over 100 pounds to lose and you're only at the beginning or whether you have 200 pounds to lose or you have 20 pounds to lose and, you know, and you've lost 10 of that, don't deprive yourself of congratulating yourself for what you've done. So um, no mean girling yourself. If you wouldn't say it to somebody that you really love, don't say it to yourself because that's just ridiculous. Um, time to put an end to that and uh, be happy about what you've accomplished. So even if you're not exactly where you want to be, that's not necessarily a bad thing. It just means that there's more progress to, made, to be made. But um, at least acknowledge the progress that you're making because if you don't, this journey is going to be way different. It can be a really positive journey or it can be kind of a drag ass, you know, oh, I still have this, or I still, I've only lost this much, and, you know, it could be that kind of journey, or it could be way more positive, and, um, I'm pretty, I'm pretty adamant that usually the people with the more positive attitudes, I really feel like they, they are the ones that, um, get to goal more often just because they, they have that positivity to push through until the end, so, um, keep it positive, be nice to yourself. No more mean girling. Don't be a D word. <laughs> and um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Are you are you mean girling yourself?
Let me know in the comments. All right, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.